thousands of cultures and art forms. In spite of all this difference, uh, we still uh, somehow manage to work together and live together as one country and that is something I am always uh, fascinated about. I consider it as my playground um, and my school uh, because everything that I do today I learned using the internet and uh, most of my work wouldn't be possible uh, without the internet. My definition of spirituality is always evolving. Uh, at the core of it is uh, definitely the sense of being connected to something beyond this physical reality. Uh, with that uh, in mind, I would say Internet is definitely capable of uh, creating some sort of virtual collective consciousness if you think about it, like how people connect and uh, you know share the same perspective. I am so grateful to have reached a place in my life uh, where I'm able to do uh, you know whatever I love doing and uh, combine all the things that I've learned so far and my life experiences and to uh, express in the form of visual art and uh, you know be creative. It's a huge list uh, of places, people, stories, uh, concepts but uh, if I must pick I would say Music and technology is what inspires me the most. I haven't really, uh, you know, monetized my artworks. Uh, so, I, as of now, I just keep creating, uh, you know, art that means something to me. So it's definitely about self-fulfillment than uh, the commercial aspect of it. But yeah, I do uh, take up design projects or uh, creative work. At first I thought uh, it will have a huge impact, especially the social isolation measures and you know being forced to stay at home. But then I realized that I have been working from home for a very long time and uh, you know, it's usually uh, me by myself and isolation is, you know, nothing new to me. In fact, uh, solitude, uh, I would say, is a big, uh, you know, is an integral part of my creative process. This year I'm showcasing a few selected artworks. Um, and the cool thing is, uh, these artworks are created using uh, artificial intelligence. This is the first time I am experimenting with that. Basically, uh, a machine learning model which is trained to recreate uh, styles of classic painters. Uh, so, the artworks are fully generated using uh, you know, uh, AI. So, I hope you guys uh, check it out and maybe you can spot the styles of the artists that I am trying to recreate. If someone's, uh, you know, letting cultural stereotypes uh, influence their decision making, um, it's a problem I cannot help them with. So I would say I'll ignore it and just move on with my life and do what I do. I'll be just happy to if I'm, you know, if I'm able to, if I manage to uh, inspire even one person to take the risk and uh, pursue something that they are really passionate about uh, because I know how rewarding that is. It might seem a little scary in the beginning but uh, if you persevere, if you keep working and you know every time uh, you face some challenges and then you overcome, the, the joy that you experience is uh, priceless. So, I would say go for it, uh, go after what you're passionate about, uh, never give up.